Nothing, baby. Go back to sleep, okay? No, oh, no, no. What time it is? Now, if you wait for me for the next 30 minutes, you do not see me. Call daddy, okay? If it doesn't pick, call Aunt Sarah, okay? Now listen, no matter what you hear, no matter what you hear, do not come out. Did you hear me? Yes, mommy. Okay, mommy loves you, baby. I love you too, mommy. Okay, baby. Baby, what are you doing here? Were you going to hit me with that? You scared me. I thought we were going to oh. ah. Come here. Come here, come here, come here. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. We're expecting you. Especially since your flight was uh, cancelled. That's right, it was cancelled. How did you get here? I had to board another flight, but I remembered that Ken Car leaves. <gasps> oh, I have to go. What? Where are you going? Ken is holed up in her wardrobe upstairs. Thanks to your double seven stunts, Miss Car. Come on, baby, I didn't know. Hold on! Daddy! 
I'm already packed. My princess, your daddy is gonna really, really miss you. I'm missing more, Dad. Anyway, Mom said I'll be back by summer. Yeah. Just know that Daddy is always here for you, okay? Daddy loves you so much, but I've got to leave now. Otherwise, Daddy will be so late for work. All right, Daddy. Have a nice day. I told Mommy to take care of you. Oh, you did. <laughs> Daddy loves you, okay? Bye-bye. Bye, Daddy. Bye, baby. And Juka, please don't give Nani any trouble, okay? Take care of Nani like you want mommy to take care of daddy, okay? Okay. Okay, bye-bye. So how is Nani? She's great, but I miss you and mommy. Oh, we miss you more. I'm home. Where are you? Yeah, over here in the room. Is that mommy's voice? Yes, darling. And who is your darling? Oh. Come over here and see. Come and see my new girlfriend. My new girlfriend? Can I speak with? Hey, baby. Mm, how are you? I'm fine, mommy. I miss you. I miss you, my honey. Just that before you know what's going on, you'll be back for the holidays. Okay, okay, okay. Okay, darling, now. We have to go now. I have to go and fix something for your mom to eat, okay? I'm cooking for her. Okay. Um, so we'll talk to you tomorrow, okay? Take care of Nanny, okay? Love you. Love you. Love you, baby. Bye. Bye. Oh, that's my phone ringing. <laughs> Hey, girly. Mm, yes. I'm sorry I missed your call earlier. Mm, I would have called back, but you skipped my mind. Yes. Mm, yes, tomorrow is Saturday. Yes. Okay, darling. All right. Okay, sweet. See you here. I'll let, I'll, uh, yes, yes, I will. Okay, baby. Good night. Bye. It's Zara. She sends her greetings. Hmm. Should I? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, I'm tired. You need to rest. Mm. You care so much about everybody else. You forget to take care of yourself. Mm. So, uh, I'm going to leave you in bed. Mm. Go to the kitchen and fix you something mm. really delicious. Mm -hmm. ah. Okay? That would be nice. Yes, that would be nice. All right. And when I get back, mm. whilst you're eating my food, I'm gonna eat your food also. Because um, I know how to eat your food more than you know how to eat my food. Okay. <laughs> you bad, bad, bad. <laughs> All right, I'll be waiting. Okay. Zara. Okay. And um, I hope you came with my book. <laughs> so that you can roast me. No? Huh? I'm totally not giving you the pleasure of that. I brought the book with me. It's in the car. Okay, so tell me, do you like my book? Like it? I don't like it. I love it. I love the book. But actually, we're saving review for next time. We have to step now. Really. And where are we going? Miss Hot Stepper. Oh. Miss Hot Stepper. You just reminded me of that song back in school. Do you remember? What? Um, here comes the hot step. Uh, Murderer. Uh, <laughs> Murderer. Excuse me, Mr. <laughs> Officer. Murderer. Oh, oh my goodness. Hey, let's give it to my phone. Oh, 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 the girls are there now. Yeah, we have to go there. there. Yeah. Okay. Uh, my sister's actually been around. Are you for real? Yeah. So six weeks around? Um, yes, for about a week or so. Oh. <laughs> All right, in that case, I'll see how we'll get back. Isn't it? Uh, yes. Um, can I just pick something up? Oh, I'll be in the car. I'll meet you in the car. All right, darling. Okay. Bye. Hey, Zay. What happened? Why did you come out? I'm 
not just in the right frame of mind for pleasant dreams. We'll talk about it when I come back. Is that fine? Cheer up, okay? Okay. Have fun. I'll try. Take care of you. Breakfast. You looked hungry. <laughs> I wasn't hungry while I slept. Aren't you? Oh, so hungry. Really had drinks and lots of dancing. Sister I never got to meet, right? Mm. We'll be here for dinner. She's such a sweet girl.
What's wrong? What's, what's going on? You have been moody since you got back. Did I offend you? You, you know you can talk to me. So please, talk. I miss, I miss mom. I miss her too, but I, I know she's fine wherever she is. And I'm sure she misses us as well. Famous Ziggy will have never had a pleasure mm -hmm. of meeting. Mm-hmm. <laughs> what do you mean, sir? It's a pleasure to finally meet you. <laughs> Same here. Come in, ladies. Come with me. And where's my friend? <laughs> oh my! Hey. I'm here! I'm Fuzzy, oh, how are you? Hi, girl. I smell fun. something beating. Oh, you look so nice. Ready. Already? Ouch! Ziggy, that hurts! I didn't mean it like that since sorry. Whatever. <laughs> okay, you know, um, the better part of this food you're looking at was actually made by Dubem. Hmm. Mm. Yeah, why the surprise? Why? He cooks. Wait, yes, wait, he wait. You, do you cook? Why didn't you tell me? Oh, please, girl. That's a surprise only I wanted to experience. Aww. Thank you very much. Okay, <laughs> now, can someone please pray before we dig in? <clears throat> um, Ziggy, you want to give you a try? Bless the meal for us. Okay, um... Uh, Heavenly Father, we thank you for this meal, for this family. Bless this meal in Jesus' name. Amen. 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 So Amen. Come on, Let's help yourself. Help yourself. Amen. Um, should I do orange juice or guava? Orange juice is just fine. Orange juice is okay. Let's <laughs> dig in. All right. Yeah. Amen. That's a good one. Oh my God! Sorry. Just a little too. You haven't eaten the whole day. We're already pumping you with food. I'm sure once I get the pot belly, you are going to need to make sure everything. Can you imagine? Can you imagine? Did you just? That means the second part. Yeah. Did, did you just ask me that? Yeah. I, <laughs> yeah. Actually, did. That's what I see here in the house. I tell oh you. my goodness! Wow. Oh, thank you so much, darling. Thank you. The food was awesome. You're so welcome. <laughs> thank you, Dubin. Mm. Oh. And no one is <laughs> thanking me. <you. laughs> uh -huh. Okay. I will. I will. See you. Bye bye. Bye, sir. I'll be inside the match society anytime now, okay? okay you. you girls can stay here and do all your gossip and all. Hey, we'll see you. Girl. Mm. He's amazing. <laughs> I know, I know. Still the same man I fell for. <laughs> Despite our years together. How oh, I know men are not the same. Oh. I I wish I was lucky back Come here. Come on, girl. You're one amazing woman. Stop that. Oh. 
Ziggy, it was a pleasure having you. I hope to God I'll see more of you. Bye. Good night, darling. Good night. Bye. All right, babe. I'll see you Thursday, right? Or Wednesday? Oh, Wednesday. All right. All right, then. Okay. Bye. Good night. Good night. Bye. See you next. Go. Stay home and you know sleep while I come out and jog. So. Oh, oh, I can imagine different strokes for different folks. Yeah. <laughs> You're right. Well, I've got to run. I have just one hour to get to the office. So. Oh, really? So, what do you do? I'm an architect. Oh, cool. Um, I wish you all the best. Um, thank you. <laughs> and what do you do too? I have this job interview this morning. Interview? Mm hmm Fresh graduates um, in the job market. Okay. You'll get one. Okay. Pretty soon. Thank you. Uh, so, um... Uh, <laughs> I'm gonna race you, you to this. Race me where? Come on! Come on! <laughs> Hey. Go back. You early. I know. What do you have here? Tea, coffee? It's just a yes. Okay. Your iced tea is in the fridge. Every other thing is um on the kitchen table inside. Okay. Thank um, you. All right. Mm. Oh, sit up. Mm. I saw Ziggy at the park. Ziggy? Yeah. Zara's sister? Yeah, she came oh. for a run also. I see. <laughs> Ziggy has always loved to work out. Mm. It's always been her thing. <laughs> mm. Yeah. Okay, but uh, can I quickly bring my designs so you can take a look at it? What design again? Uh, sweetheart, the, the project, the housing project. You oh. know I want your approval. Just look at it, tell me it's good. Before I submit, please, please. Darling, you know, you know I'm late for work. Blessed. Hey, babe. Someone sounds so excited, like I doing well. Yes, they loved it. That means you got the contract. Yes, your man got the contract. I'm on my way home, babe. Home to you. Great. I already made up in a great time with you. 
Oh, okay, babe. Uh, uh, I'll talk to you later, babe. Okay, babe. Hurry up. Hurry. Bye bye. Love you. I've been standing there for more than 20 minutes. I'm sorry, that's how it's like most times. Taxis ah. are so scarce around here. <laughs> how would you know that? You have a car, you never have to stand by the roadside <laughs> to get a cab. <laughs> it will surprise you that I'm a typical hmm? Yeah. Really? I should. <laughs> <laughs> by the way, um, yeah. how did your interview go? How did you know I went for an interview? Who told you I went for an interview? God. Come on, you told me. <laughs> oh. Besides, this power I see sticking out of your bag, I'm sure it contains all your credentials. Yes, actually, and it went well. I got the job. Really? Oh, congratulations. <laughs> I told you you would. <laughs> yeah, you did. <laughs> I remember you telling me that. Anyways, how was your, how was your presentation? I gotta go. <gasps> Congratulations! <laughs> this calls for a party then. Well, uh, Uri is waiting for me in the house. So what are you talking about, Uri? I'm talking about us doing it right here now. You mean in the car? Oh, I mean jamming up the music. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> yeah, right. <laughs> Oh, I'll oh, show your skills. Yeah, that's the skills. Yeah, I can see that. I was there. Try to try something. Try now.
Zing. Oh my goodness. What the? What happened to her? Uh, she sprained her ankle. She needs to see a doctor. Oh my goodness, there's, there's no need going in. Let's just go to the hospital. Uh, no, don't worry. I'll just call my friend to come check me. Is your friend a doctor? Yes. I think we should get her to sit down. Oh, okay. Yes, sir. Thank you. Sorry, dear. Wow. Easy, 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 easy. Dusty. Sorry. Let's take this off. Sorry. Oh, sorry. Don't you okay, know. then call, call this your friend. Call, call the person <laughs> fast. Easy, easy, easy. I'll call to make sure she's doing good. Okay, thank you. Excuse Hello. my manners. Thanks for bringing her, please. Oh, thank you. Yes, Hello. Hello, can you hear me? Okay. okay. And then, mind you, hear me. Great. I need it. Okay. Oh, thank okay. you. You take care of her, okay? I'll try. Okay, um, how are you? Yeah? Is the person coming now? How soon is the person coming? So soon. So sorry. Ah. Um, sorry. You can go. I'll be fine. I I, I can't go to work leaving you. You know, in, in, I, I, I can't I can't leave you pain. Just a sprained ankle. I'm not crippled. At least not yet. Uh, just just go. And I promise you, I won't leave here till my friend comes. I'll feel worse if I'm the reason you're late to work. So please, just don't worry. I'll be fine. Just go. Okay, please. but just call me if you need anything, okay? Take it easy. All right then, bye. Hey, darling. Hi. Sorry, I didn't want to wake you up. Mm. How are you? I had it when I got back, so I took some aspirin and decided to rest. Oh. How are you feeling now? I'm better. I'm good to dish your food. <laughs> compartment of the fridge. It should be frozen by now. Zara called. Says Ziggy is better. Okay, that's good to hear. You should go and see them tomorrow, baby. I don't think that will be possible. We have a media briefing for a client tomorrow. Okay. If I'm done with Chief early tomorrow, I will go and check up on them. Make sure you eat. All right. Game. Oh, it's the same game. Film and theatre styles. Ryan and Colin, just come down. I'll give you a scene in a moment. We want some more film styles, theatre styles. Er erotic thriller, pantomime striptease. Film noir. Oh, no theatre. No theatre. All right, give some film theatre. John Wayne. 
Amateur dramatics. That's, that's essentially what is going on before your eyes already. <laughs> Let's do a uh, scene. Uh, first snorkeling lesson. Ah. Ah. Sure. Straightforward one. And I'll give you some styles in a moment. Before we go underwater, Bill, I want you to review the equipment once more with me. This is a snorkel. All righty. <laughs> hey, thank. And this is... Left hand, Stuart. Free kick, then, Wigan. Oh, it's a bit short to Jacobs. Jacobs tricks his way into the box as well. Jacobs pulls it across goal. Too much on that. Hey! Hi. Um, How are you? I'm much better. Well, I'm, I'm, I'm really sorry. I've been so busy lately. I should have come back earlier to check up on you. Oh, it's okay. I understand. Oh, thanks for taking our time to Okay. Oh. So, how is work? Uh, it's okay, fine. Um, thank you. Uh, Zara, where is she? Um, no, still a little Oh. Yeah. I see you also a sports fan. Yes. <laughs> Go ask for life. What? <laughs> You mean you you are an Arsenal fan? Yes. <laughs> you don't mean it. Me too. The hard Arsenal fan. Wow. <laughs> oh, that makes two of us then. Oh, damn. The match is only starting. It's been now. I've got to go now. I just came back to make sure you are okay, and I see you doing good. So, uh, um, thanks, but you don't have to go. We could watch the match together. Ah, well, you know I. I usually watch the match home. Even though Uri is not much of a sports fan, but she still allows me to watch my match in peace. Ah, uh, and the thing is, I actually like it better on the big screen and um, I, uh, I haven't been out of the house in the spring my uncle. So. Um, and um, Zara is busy. Uh, well, I, I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, you'll be home in less than two hours. Okay, let's go. Oh. 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 You okay? Yeah. Oh. Oh. Okay. You okay? Yeah, I'm fine. You okay too? Oh, no, no, no. Say, say, I'm fine. It's okay. I'm fine. I was just. I'm, I'm fine. Just, you know, let me go. Yeah, don't. <laughs> yeah, I'm fine. I'm fine. I'm fine. It's just, you know, so much except me. Um, I. Yeah, you should go in there. Yeah, I calls. should. I should go. Thank you. Okay. Take it easy, okay? <laughs> I'll be right back. <laughs> he got the brick as well, didn't he? Here's the free kick. Comes off the defender. Oh, he doesn't have that that well, does So, shall we? Sure. Let's go. Back off the defender, but my God, did he hit that? Please answer your phone. Pick this call. Pick your calls.
damn. What? Shit, or it will kill me, or it will kill me, or it will kill me. So many missed calls. I'm sorry, it's my fault. I enjoyed every bit of it. Oh shit. Now oh, she's calling again. Let me take you home, okay? Okay. Hey, sweetheart. Hey, B. Where have you been? Where did you go? I'm sorry, sweetheart. I went to watch too much. The match? Yeah. Well, you always watch it here. What happened? What's, what's the, the boys, first time? the boys, they insisted I go to watch with them. Oh, <sighs> I didn't answer my calls. I didn't take my calls. Come here, me. come here, come here, sit down. I know it sounds silly, but uh, I left my phone in the car. I didn't want to be distracted, so I just dropped it in the car. That's not happened again. It will never, ever happen again. You sure? I'm sure. <laughs> okay, let me go get your food. Oh, I'm not really hungry, baby. You're not hungry? Who gave you food? What did you eat? I'm famished. Go and get my food. All right, <laughs> all right. I'll be right back. I'll just stay from me. Dear diary, I think I found my first poem. To Bem, and so far all my plans seem to be working accordingly. I will find out if he really deserves a good woman or he's just like the rest of them. What's wrong with me? I'm becoming so attached to Ziggy. I'm beginning to like her. I hope I'm not falling for her. No, that can't be. That can't be. I will not disrespect myself like that. I love my wife and Uri is the best thing that has ever happened to me. let myself make this mistake again. I won't call you anymore. I have to stop this friendship before it lands me in trouble. No calls. No more will I check on you. No calls.
you not picking my calls now? Uh -uh. time to say thank you to the Ben. Okay. But I have to change and freshen up. If that will make you happy. Alright, excuse me. Alright then. Yes? Mm, come in! Mm. Wow! That is getting bigger, isn't it? Wow! <laughs> John! Hey, how oh, are you? Surprise! <laughs> wow! It's been long! <laughs> oh my god, you didn't even tell me you were coming out to me. Uh, she didn't come to see me when I sprained my ankle. I miss oh. you so much. I can. I'm so sorry, Zee. Please forgive me. You're welcome. You're welcome. Yeah. Hey. Oh, good day, sir. Hey. Wow. Wow. Just wow. so <laughs> beautiful. Thank you. Um, you've not been taking or returning my calls. Are you avoiding me? Trust me, it's for your own good, Ziggy. What are you afraid of? I'm afraid of hurting my wife. Girl, how's the Lord? When is he coming back? Next week. Girl, I haven't seen him in weeks. So what is wrong with that man? Excuse me. We don't even know what this is. Can we at least talk uh, at the park? Stop. Oh, this... This is really beautiful. Okay, people. Oh, okay. We have cold drinks here. Who wants something <laughs> other than um one? Good morning, sis. Where are you going? Going for a run. Liar. Excuse me. I heard your conversation with Dubem yesterday. Oh, you did? You're kidding me, right? He's married to my friend, who is like a sister to you. 
Oh. But thank God she's not my sister. I saw you weren't coming. Amir. What are we doing? I don't know, but I'd like to find out. I can't. Look me in the eye and tell me you don't feel something.
Abs. Sweetheart, I'm, 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 I'm sorry. Please. Get off me! Sweetheart, take it easy, please. Don't talk to strangers. Honey. I don't talk to strangers. Honey, please. And the person standing in front of me is a stranger. And for the sake of our child, I hope she's worth it. Babe, babe, I, I... Get off me! Oh my God. What have I done? What have I done? <laughs>
slow down. Slow down, you. Ah! God, I just. It's just so naughty. <laughs> God. Alright, see now my bag has dropped. So you oh. can get your little hair down. See now my bag has dropped. So. When you're getting paid to kiss someone on camera, it's a bonus if you enjoy kissing that someone in real life, too. These television couples mix business with pleasure, two varying degrees of success. Good evening, sis. What do you think you're doing? Uh, nothing. Uh, oh, oh, sorry, I don't understand what you mean. Why do you want to come in between a man and his wife? No, I'm not. Or just persons who share some natural likes. That's all. Is that a justification for getting so attached to a married man? The fact Ure is quiet about it doesn't mean you should continue doing what is wrong. I understand you and I'll be careful in my conduct. Care for some junk food? No thanks. Have dinner. Scott Foley. Jennifer Garner played Scott Foley's on-screen girlfriend in Felicity, and she became his off-screen wife, too. The pair married in 2000 and divorced in 2003, around when she met Ben Affleck. Foley told TV Guide the breakup was nobody's fault. Quote, there was no other relationship, there was no infidelity, nothing. Dear Diary, I met someone today. I kind of liked him even though he's supposed to be off limits for me. He's married. But well, one thing amused me though. He was started as holier than thou. 
<laughs> eh? <laughs> in 2015, a faithful husband, especially one the same circle with Donald the dog. It looks to me like a challenge worth taking up, but we shall see. 18th June 2015. Dear diary, I've had it. Enough of my sister dedicating praise and worship sessions for this Mr. Dubem Ukiwe. The game is on now. We shall see how a friend of Donald the dog would stand the pleasure of another woman's company other than his wife. July 2nd. The plan is unfolding, dead diary of mine. He held me in his arms today, courtesy of that blessed twist of my ankle, or say, twist of fate. <laughs> ah, I could feel his breath quicken. Principled my foot. I should try acting sometime. I could make a fortune for me, you know. July 29th. Diary dearest. Today Olympus has fallen. Ha! <laughs> like a pack of cards. Or should I say, that's how the cookie crumbled? Uh, something's off me. Am I beginning to feel something? No, 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 no. Must be the hormones. Again no. is what it is. Okay. Hello, baby. Are you home? Outside. Uh, um, <laughs> okay, I'll, I'll be with you right away. already um why are you back so soon what is the problem a round of applause for the very talented actress so it was all a game to you it was all a game to you I, I, get out of my car now baby what are you don't, talking about? Don't, don't, don't you ever baby me again. Out! What does all this mean? Eh? And where is all this coming from? Wait, wait, where is all this coming from? 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 Okay. I read your diary. What diary? So how many have you got? Five? Then, and to think that I was, I, I was going to turn my back on my wife. For you, the woman that God has blessed me with. For what? This? This? Okay. Okay. I'll tell you, but it's not what you think. It all started as a joke. And I enjoyed it. But that was until... Until I fell in love with you. And it didn't just start like that. The man, my sister, Zara, happens to be married to you, is my boyfriend. What? 
it all started while I was in the university. We dating and then I went for service. And by the time I came back,
Dear diary, do not break my heart. He's seeing someone new, and sadly that person happens to be my sister. Yes, my sister. I don't know what to do. Dara has been good to me. For God's sake, she raised me. Truly, all men are the same. Liars, shits, and low-down scumbags. <laughs> When I considered what that would do to the relationship I had with my sister and the fact that she had waited too long to settle down, I let it go. But then it turned to blackmail and it started forcing me to, to, to sleep with him in exchange for keeping quiet. And seeing with my sister. I am not your woman, and I never will be. Once my woman, always my woman. Says who? Says the damn. Do not be done. Oh, you mean Donald the dog? I still want my girl. Um, Donald, you can't be doing this now. You're dating my sister now. I know you still want me. Just like I want you. I am sister too. Donald. <laughs> Donald, just... Donald! Stop! Stop! <laughs> Donald. Today, I let the man I love... loved... treat me like a whore. I've never felt this low in my entire life. I will make sure I pay every man back in their own coin. I prove to the world they are all the same. What are you talking about? I became bitter. I became so bitter and I went rampaging, hurting and breaking men. But baby, that was, that was until I met you. Until you met me? Until you met me? Then you set another target for yourself? You won. You won. Thank you. No. Thank you for putting me in the same leagues with the gods. Yes. Thank you. Yeah. And let me warn you. Never. 
will you ever come close to me in your entire miserable life? Ever? Or do I still be hell? Baby, help! Help! Can we just... Please, let's just... We can talk... We can... We can sort this out! Please! Go to hell! Baby, don't, help! Baby, don't leave me! Hey. Talk about this! Hi. Hi, stranger. No, I'm Tedo. Oh, nice name. Where's that from? Well, I'm from Benway, Teeth to be precise. All right. Are you okay? You seem to be celebrating something. What's the occasion? What's the occasion? <laughs> the occasion? You wanna know? Really wanna know? A damn shitty life. The lions come on the earth for a husband. Wow. I really don't mean to butt into your business, but uh, no, no, no. I, I think you've had enough. Please, no problem. I'll, I'll, I'll take care of this. I. Did you just stop my drink? You're damn right, Mister. You have no business butting into my life. Stop my drink. Wait, wait, wait. wait, wait. You know, I'll, I'll be right back. Put that on my child. If this text hadn't come to confirm my earlier suspicions, when were you going to tell me? I said, when did you plan on telling me? There's one more thing. You see?
I don't know where to start from, but I'll start by saying I am I'm, I'm sorry. I I do I totally understand why you haven't been picking my calls till 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 now. I can't <sighs> come to terms with the fact that my own sister has been a complete stranger for the better parts of our lives. My sob story doesn't doesn't matter now. It just, it boils down to the fact that I brought problems to your home. And I am sorry, Ure, my friend. I'm sorry. Just, what, what can I do? My own sister had an affair with my husband years ago. Yes, I know. I know about that. But, what did you mean? You knew? Yes. The diary. What, what diary are you talking about? Siggins. That's how I got to find out about she and Dubem. Apparently she forgot it with Dubem, who left it carelessly and I found it. From Zara, I saw more than just that. You need to be careful with that girl. Um, she's worse than you think. What? What more can she do then? The damage is already done. Zara, uh, that girl has a dark side to her that will make a snake green with envy. And while you're entirely not of my betrayal radar, yes, you're not, you're not of my betrayal radar. Even at that, I would advise you tread softly with her. You really don't know her. You're right when you say you don't know her. Uri, what dark side are you talking about? And how dark is this side? I, I, am I supposed to be scared? The system is dark to me. You should. I don't understand why I'm talking 
to you unconventionally. But <laughs> that means that that's the only way out. <laughs> that's the only way out. Um, <clears throat> Ure, you be so quiet. You not say the word. <sighs> well, 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 I understand. I understand. I understand your pain and your answer questions. But if you learn how to release some steam, some tension, you get to find from that are so dominant? Is it anger? Is it bitterness? Is it strife? Is it disappointment? By the time you do all this, I tell you the truth, you come out better. <sighs> well, since we are on that platform of love and God, I think let's continue from there. Have you made progress? Bure, you look far better today. Have you read the books? Yes, I have. Has it been of any help to you at all? Are you the baby? Um, it just highlights my own failures as a, as a husband. So where do you think you have failed? I overlooked uh, Ori's uniqueness and uh, individuality. And I, I retain a certain picture, a certain mood in my head that I expect her to fit right into. I got careless. I let down my guard and I allowed the youthful exuberance of the younger woman to. Uh, uh, cloud my judgment and my reasoning and my own stupid personal interest to get the best of me. I mean, my wife was perfect uh, before the younger woman came along and after that, I I started to feel that uh, my wife could do much more in supporting my own interest. You guess. You dare to make light of what you did. You guess I was premeditating. Which is it? You tell me that you chose to cheat on me. Not just with anybody, but with my best friend's younger sister. <laughs> or that you couldn't just do it discreetly. With your scarcely veiled disdain for me while at it. Is that how you qualify the horror you put me through this past few months? Baby. Don't you baby me, you low down rotten skunk of a man. You just said it yourself. You went for a younger woman, for the younger man. Yeah, what am I even doing here? I think you should say take the love for me. Doctor, do you think she's leaving? Calm down, calm down. You're making progress. We're just scratching. 
touched the surface. I'm sorry, you heard what she said. Calm down, relax. You said it that she's been like a log of food for the past three months. You should be happy that she's making this kind of abort. You shouldn't be afraid. No. You should be happy. So. trying to build your home. Way before now. But I tried and you, you didn't give me the chance. You shut me out. <sighs> like hell, I should have let you in. 
אורי, within the months you were not communicating with your husband, what and what were going on in your mind? my marriage vows seriously. That was my turn to say, how dare you? And how dare you? Indeed, you take your vows seriously. What's the proof you didn't sleep with him? What's the proof? You talk about he was just a shoulder to cry on. Like I wasn't there trying my best to, 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 to make it up to you. Now, listen. I don't want your lying ass betraying shoulder. Oh, yeah? As for Tedo, you can make any kind of investigation you want. I don't even think you can try to make these tables turn on me because I'm not about to let you do that. If you had any ounce of integrity, we would not be having this conversation right now. Okay, wait, sit down, 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 sit down. Sit down. It's good that this uh, accusation and counter accusation are coming from both of you. That's heady enough. But the earlier we get down to business, the better. You both have um, you read the books I gave you to read? Yes. You did? So I think we start from the questions um, you may want to ask from them. Well, doctor. Chapter 11 of the book. Page 142, 142 precisely. A paragraph there opens with the words, love has nothing to do with feelings. I mean, am I supposed to believe that? Are you trying to say that my feelings right now are not in order? Uh, not really, Ure. That's a good question you've asked. But since we decided to start on golf factor, I think that's a very good foundation before we go into clinical aspect of it. You understand? Good. Um, that statement does not negate human feeling of love. It goes further to make you love so deeply that you give up on wrongs. Or better still, hold on to grudges. It simply means that you love despite. And if you look well, the preceding pages, you see all manner of loves there. The only one that can sustain your marriage is Agape. I don't know if you're following me. And then, um, since both of you have been able to finish the books I gave you, the first book I gave you, I think I haven't finished mine. Lubem. It's all right, it's all right, it's all right. Um, sometime next week, I'll be going to Jalingo for a seminar. Uh, and since our appointment is next week, I suggest we make it midweek. That is weekend. But before then, I plead with you to do everything possible to finish the book. It will help us. Please. I did not do anything. 
How dare you do this to me? You did this to yourself, sis. Donald was mine before you took him away from me. Don't listen to her. Shut up. It's time she knows. Knows what? That, that you betrayed me with him? Sis, Donald is not evil. I will shut up. See? 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 Siggy, why, why did you do this? Siggy, why did you just call the ambulance, please? Call the ambulance, Siggy. Siggy, get up, get up. Siggy, call the ambulance, call the ambulance. Oh my goodness, Siggy, 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 oh, oh my God, Siggy, 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 Siggy.